Hello my brothers and sisters and welcome back to another Ration Packed episode Ow. of Crystal Butcher and Friends. Do you know what? We're delving back into the JD seasonings that in the kitchen with Pen sent us. She sent us loads of them. Absolutely tons of them. So if you haven't already, get over to In The Kitchen With Pen and press subscribe. As usual, the link will be in the description. And also the link to the jdseasonings.com will be in the description as well. And today we're having chips and wedges. Why not? I'll put in other things with it, but you're not going to see that because I'm not bothered. You know what I mean? I just, I just want to do some chips and wedges with some good old-fashioned jacks. Dirty potatoes. So yeah. Also, yes, I am also. This is the first recipe, the first cooking video, proper cooking video. I'm going to do in the K10. You can't see it there. All you can see is the end of my finger. The K10 Ultenic Air Fryer. So yeah, chips and wedges in a brand new air fryer. Let's do it. So the first thing we've got to do is we've got to peel and chip them potatoes. And do you know what I haven't done in a long while is done the magic knife. It's not quite the magic knife, but I have just blessed it. So uh, let's get on with it. Fucking magic. Our chips, actually wedges, are in the bowl. And I've got some weird. Fucking love garlic for our lights in this house. Uh, I'm just going to spray them because I want that seasoning to stick proper. And it's one cow per spray, so I'm going to spray about 100,000 sprays. <laughs> oh, shit. Hang on, 10 second reel. I got it. Bang. There we are. Right, so we got the. Uh, let's get our hands in. We got our uh, garlic for our lights in there. I'm not, now I'm just going to actually just throw the chips and wedges seasoning. It looks very paprika-ish. I'll show you now. Look at that. Get it in. And just get your hands in. Get it seasoned. You want caught it, you know what I mean. There you go. There's loads of seasoning at the bottom of that bowl there. You want it caught, you want everything. You want to get all that crap up. JD seasonings. Uh, I haven't blanched the potatoes by the way either because it never told me to in the instructions. Also, if I did, they'd probably actually smash up and end up like uh, a JD seasonings uh, chips and wedges mash. And that is not what we want. Look at stare at that. I think I've lost half of it on my fingers. But there we are. There is our. Chips and wedges. Well, the wedges aren't. There's no chips in there. Uh, seasoning. And uh, we're going to preheat the K10. And uh, get them in. And because I'm using the K10 Ultenic, uh, I've actually preheated it. I've pressed the preheat button. You can't see it right now. Uh, it's 205 degrees for five minutes. And that is similar to what the chips are going on. Not the time, obviously. It's going to be about camera we said it'll be about 20 minutes uh, and it's going to need it because the fry setting is fries them are quite clearly fucking wedges right we'll let that preheat and then we'll bung the wedges in the k10 has uh preheated so let's put that back a bit get that we got our chips in our wedges Oh, you can't see that, but that looks absolutely orgasmic. Right, so we're going to get them in. 
press the button, push it in. I know it says, hang on, there you go. I know it says end. Press on. Oh, we're pressing on. Yep. Yeah. Fries. Bish bash. Hang on, I pressed off by accident. We'll start again. Fries. Start. I will shake them after 10 minutes. Hopefully, and they'll be uh, good to go. It's been 20 minutes. And there they are. The wedges. Let's push that back. I'll do. There they are. Look. Crispy. And look. A little bit burnt. <laughs> but they smell absolutely superb. So I'm going to get them in a bowl. And we're going to get up here. And slide them down my gizzard. There it is. The JD seasoning chips and wedges courtesy of pen in the kitchen with pen and uh, jdseasonings.com there it is look at it just brings a new dimension to your chips or your wedges that is burnt but I bet that is flavour Mm. Mm. I've not added any salt or pepper to these or vinegar although I think a bit of vinegar might be nice what can I salt what can I Doesn't half. You know what? Doesn't half enhance what would be basically a boring potato, I suppose. But hey, uh, chips and wedges, JD seasonings, absolutely banging. You gotta try it. Buy some yourself. Get on the uh, website in the description below. Also, get over to In the Kitchen with Pen in the description below because I loved it if you like this press like comment share it on your social media and subscribe and become a family member of hashtag team CT B where I fucking love you